everyone, it's Nicky D, and I realize that you guys do not know who that is, but hi, I'm Nicky D, and I'm starting a YouTube channel. So this is my first ever YouTube video ever, and so be nice to me, please, because it's my first YouTube video ever, so be nice. I know the internet can be kind of mean, and I'm hoping that you guys like me. Please, please. Um, yeah, anyway, I'm gonna stop embarrassing myself in my first ever video and just get on with it. So, for my first ever video, ever, <laughs> I decided to do a clothing haul because it was recently my birthday and graduation, so I got a bunch of, like, money and gift cards, which, side note, thank you so much to my friends and family who were so generous, way more generous than I was expecting, so... Thank you. And I'm just going to get on with it. So the first place that I went was Charlotte Russe. And the thing that first caught my eye was this shirt. And obviously I ended up buying it. But it's just so cute. It's like this striped shirt. And what? That was really high pitched. But look at how gorgeous the bottom is. I just think that's so like unique and different. But yeah, anyways, this kind of fits sort of loose. And it's a little bit like you can see a little bit of your skin through the lace. But it's nothing very inappropriate because I mean it's pretty thick lace and I don't know I just I'm obsessed with lace obviously and crochet so I had to have this and it was on sale for ten dollars so that was amazing and then the next thing which is also crochet that I got at Charlotte Russe was this headband it's just really pretty and it's like this crochet and I just think it'll look really cute and kind of boho sort of and again, it looks really stupid with this shirt because it makes it look not so white, but yeah. Anyways, I just really liked this, and this was about $5. And on to the next place that I went, which was Forever 21. And at Forever 21, my lace obsession continued, and I got this shirt, which is so beautiful. This was $22.80, which is kind of expensive for Forever 21, but really not expensive um, in general. And... It's just glorious. Oh my gosh, am I saying that again? Really? I need to figure out a different adjective. It's it's adorable. And I just love how it's scalloped at the bottom. And just the whole pattern of the lace is very kind of scalloped. And I think that's so pretty. And even the sleeves are scalloped. It's just so like dainty and adorable. The other lace thing is this shirt that I'm wearing right now, which is just this... Ugh, trying to stand up and show you guys um but yeah this is just a lace tank top and what I loved about it was that it had a like um lining underneath which a lot of lace things like this you have to wear a tank top underneath it um but this is like it's got a tank top already in it so you don't have to worry about that so I just thought this was really nice and really perfect for the summer because in the summer you don't want to be wearing like a tank top and then a lace shirt over it and then a bra and it's just it's just too many straps and yeah I just I don't know, I really liked that it was quite simple and it was just all sort of built in. So it also has like a razor back, which I really like. Um, and I think that was $13. So anyways, this is the last lace thing that I got at Ace and M. You guys probably think I'm obsessed, which isn't far from the truth. Um, but I got this beautiful lace skirt at H&M and I love again how it's sort of scalloped at the bottom. I think that's so pretty and this was about $15. It was originally $34.95 but it was on sale for $15 and I actually thought that it was going to be $7 because it was in um, like a $7 sort of rack. However, those things always say like $7 and then in little bitty font and up. And this was one of those and up items. So I was kind of disappointed that it wasn't $7, but I mean, it's still like $20 off. So I still bought it. Um, and then moving on to the non-lace things that I got. Then another shirt, or that wasn't a shirt, but a shirt that I got at H&M is this one. It's just a like purple striped collar shirt, which my favorite trends for summer is collared shirts and lace. I wear um, one or the other of those like every day in the summer. And I just thought this was really cute and casual and it's kind of big. I got it a size smaller than I usually would and it's, it's still kind of big. But I just think it's so purtiful and it's definitely something I would wear. And this was pretty cheap, I think. Yeah, it was only $9.95, so 
that's awesome for $9.95. Um, I got this amazing shirt from Forever 21, or H&M, we're on H&M, we already did Forever 21. Anyways, this is from H&M, and it's a olive, like, tank top, and I just thought this was really pretty. It has gold buttons, and it's quite long. It's a little bit higher on the sides, which I think is really flattering, <laughs> and you have no idea how long I've wanted an olive tank top, because I saw this picture, um, it was for, like, Michael Kors, and the model was wearing a olive tank top, and she was out, like, in a safari jeep, and it was amazing. She was, like, super tan, and I was like, I want to be that girl on a safari that's super tan, so at least now I can be that girl with an olive tank top. I'm not super tan, nor going on a safari, but at least I have an olive tank top, and I can feel like I'm going on a safari. And overall, I just, I think this color is really flattering on my skin tone, and really on most people's skin tone, so... Yeah, anyways, I got that, and it was only $9.95, which is awesome. I would have paid, like, probably more than that for this, because I love the color, and I love the cut and everything. I really needed some just, like, tank tops, like, casual tank tops, because I tend to always buy um, kind of, like, fancier stuff, and stuff that's not really for my everyday life, but this is definitely everyday life appropriate. It's just this... Um, white, white and red striped tank top with two little um, bows on the side, which I think is really cute. And this is from Wet Seal. I don't think I even said that it was from Wet Seal, but it was an awesome deal. It was two for ten, so I got another one in a different color that I'll show you in a second. But I just thought this was really cute, and it is cropped, so I would wear this with high-waisted shorts or high-waisted pants. And I just think it's really cute and really casual and definitely something that is life-appropriate, which some other things that I tend to buy are not so appropriate just for a casual day. So yeah, I love that. And then, whoa, the other one that I got is the purple one. And this one has a knot in the front. And I think I like the red one a little bit better. Um, it looks more classic to me, I guess. Um, but I do really like this. And I think it's really cute. And again, very life appropriate. So I will be wearing these a lot in the summer. And yeah, so now on to Target, which I actually went to Target today. Um, I went to these other places on Tuesday. Now it's Friday. So anyways, I got a couple of things at Target because I had a gift card and I love Target. Like my friends and family all know to get me Target gift cards because I just love Target so much. But I got some nail polish, which I have not bought nail polish all of 2013 and now it is the end of June and I was like might as well buy some nail polish because I have so much nail polish like I've been such a hoarder of nail polish over the past few years and so it was a huge step for me not to buy nail polish for six months but I finally broke and got nail polish because these two colors just seemed amazing so the first one this is from Essie's summer collection I believe um, and it's Saturday disco fever and it's this awesome like bright orange color oh it's amazing and it doesn't have any shimmer to it, which I love. And then I got a Sally Hansen Complete Salon Manicure Nail Polish in the color Black and Blue. And I hope that you guys can see how cool this is. But it's just like this purpley blue duochrome color, which is just so cool. And I definitely have a weakness for um, like creamy bright colors like this and duochrome interesting colors like this. So these were just right up my alley and I cannot wait to use both of these. I think they are beautiful. And yeah, that was... I, I can't believe that I've lasted this long without buying nail polish, so I was quite proud of myself, and I definitely deserved these two. Um, and then I got two things from Rimmel. I got this Scandalize eyeshadow stick in the color Guilty Gray. I decided to get the gray because I really like gray on my eye color. I feel like most people don't like gray, but I really like gray sort of smudgy eyeliner. Um, I just think it looks really pretty, and so I got this. I think it'll be perfect, um, just one step sort of makeup for the summer. So, bam! I like that. Well, I don't know if I like it yet. And then I got another thing from Rimmel, and this is one of the Kate Moss lipsticks, and this is in the color 109. And are you ready for this? I don't know if you're ready for this, because this is such a beautiful color, but oh, look at this. 
look at this it's just such a rich coral color like I have been looking for a color like this for so long and I am not big on lipstick or just lip products in general but I had to get this color this color is so beautiful and it's just so creamy it doesn't have shimmer in it because I don't really like shimmer in my um lipsticks I just I don't know I feel like if you want it to be shimmery that should be in the gloss or just I don't know. I don't like shimmery lipsticks, long story short. But I just think this is so pretty and I cannot wait to wear this. I don't know when I'm going to wear it because I don't really wear lipstick on a daily basis. I feel like it is a little much um, for the casualness that is my life. But I hope that I'll have some places that I can wear this without feeling too put together and like wear it like I'm wearing too much makeup but yeah I just I love this and I think this was about four dollars I think both of these were about four dollars so yeah that's all I got at Target and that's my entire haul so thank you guys so much for watching I definitely appreciate it because this is my first video and I need all the help I can get because there are so many talented people out there on YouTube so I just hope that just like five people watch this video that would totally make my day and yeah, just anyways, long story short, thank you for watching this video and bye.